What's going on everybody? It's your boy T Spillin. Welcome to Spillin' All the Tea. Got a video for you guys. This is uh, <clears throat> going to be a tag. I am music. I'm putting this out early because I don't know how my day's going to go today. And I'm going to try to speed through this because like, you know, I'm getting ready for work. So, you know, trying to hurry up and do this, get this out. I would do this on my phone, but I want to try to give you guys some good quality. Alright, so it's 11 questions. So let's go. Who is your favorite? Oh, by the way, if you guys want to do this tag, I will leave the questions in the um, description box below. So, favorite group? It's probably going to be Earth, Wind, and Fire. You know, and by the way, y'all going to hear a lot of old shit. So, if y'all don't know about some of this music, I advise you to go uh, look into some of this music. Uh, favorite female vocalist? I'm going to have to say Shantae Moore. I mean, Sh Shantae is bad, y'all. That that girl is bad. You know what I'm saying? Like, especially when it comes to whistle, her uh, whistle register. Man, uh, my favorite female artist is going to have to be Monica. Like, it's something about Monica that I truly, truly love. And if yeah, I have every album of hers. You know, like even with her next album come like here's the thing like her last album and this ain't no shade or nothing but like i haven't even listened to the album yet truly i downloaded it and it came out, i think what like two years ago that shows you just how much i love it like i downloaded this shit like it wasn't nothing i still have to find time to listen to it and i'm going back cold red too i still ain't listen to her first thing but it is what it is i love me some monica uh favorite male vocalist if y'all know about him y'all need to learn about him lenny williams Lenny Woods will sit here and start singing to your ass and then stop singing to your ass and start talking to you in the motherfucking song. He gonna give you a story, you know, you know. So, yeah, yeah, my favorite. You know, I would like to throw Teddy P, Teddy Pendergrass in there, but you, oh, I'm gonna give you two Teddy Pendergrass. Y'all ain't ready for Teddy. Y'all ain't ready. Uh, favorite male artist overall is gonna have to be Luther Vandross. And if it's only for one reason, had it not been for Luther, I wouldn't have been here. Cause let my mama tell it, Luther was her husband. I'm pretty sure Luther was playing in the background uh, as I was being conceived. So I'm gonna have to go with Luther V on that. My favorite songs, top five. Okay, y'all, y'all, I'm gonna give y'all some old songs right now. If y'all don't know these songs, go look them up. So how can I ease the pain? By Lisa Fisher, which y'all know. As we lay by Shirley Murdoch. If loving you is wrong, do me, baby, by Prince and Jody by uh, Johnny Taylor. So five oldest, I, I dare y'all to look into them. Y'all, y'all can get y'all can get some good shit out of that. Um, type of uh, music I like, like what genre? Honestly, I don't really have a genre per se. I like listening to music where people are putting their soul into it, even if it's, if it's pop songs, like. If I can hear, you know, you putting your soul and your S's into it, I love that shit. Like, I love real singing, real music. I don't like all the overproduced shit. You know, again, I grew up in the 80s, but as y'all can see by the five songs I listed before, and I even know some more throwback songs. Who, who the hell Periscope this early in the morning? Mm -hmm. You know, just that type, you know, so like I like that shit. Um, most, uh, okay, so memorable lyric <clears throat> is going to be from Alicia Keys's uh lesson learned that was of her uh as i am album and it's when she said it's called the past because i'm getting past and i ain't nothing like i was before you ought to see me now and i kind of feel the way i think if i had to pick a nut like even if it was other lyrics i mean if you just take the song i am changing from the dream girl soundtrack that song right there is me because you know i am changing and you know so often people want to kind of like look at you as you were not realizing that i'm not that person anymore i'm changing i'm you know moving forward with my life so yes yes um uh a song that makes you feel some kind of way <clears throat> It would be a uh, hallelujah. It was uh, actually penned by Leonard Cohen. It was redone by several artists. Um, like I said, I mean, some people may not like Leonard Cohen's version of it, even though he wrote it because he's more of a baritone. And it's, but it's one of those ways like it's so fucking somber, but it's so meaningful. You feel what I'm saying? Where it's just like <clears throat> no matter what it is you're going in, through in your life, the best of the worst. Sometimes all you can say is hallelujah. I, I love that song. I do. 
And Alexandra Burke did a, did a nice rendition too. I like her live version of it rather than the uh, studio version, because I because it's like you hear the studio version, it doesn't seem like she really put her soul into it. But I think as she uh, progressed in her career, the song took hold of her, <clears throat> and when she gives it to you live, she puts her all into it. But I love the song Hallelujah. Uh, karaoke faves, uh, Let's Stay Together by Al Green. Uh, Hostage by Sia and uh, Chains by Nick Jones and my music crush <clears throat> look y'all I have two crushes in general one I mean both of them act but one is a musician number one is Angela Bassett I don't I don't know if y'all know I mean black don't crack have y'all seen Miss Angela Bassett lately and then my second uh, you know wife and this is my music crush is Vanessa Williams I ain't got shit else to say. <clears throat> Both of them bad. So this is my I Am Music tag. Hopefully uh, <clears throat> you guys enjoyed uh, my answers. I know most of uh, the tea spillers are, you know, in their 30s and up. I'm not, you know, discounting anybody that's not in their 30s and up because y'all know I'll be 29. Not next week, but the week after. <clears throat> But I know I threw some old oldies out there. If y'all don't know about some of the songs that I listed or even some of the artists that I named, I don't know what you're doing with your life. I don't know what kind of music you're listening to, but you might want to go ahead and research them. So that is all I got, you guys. Again, this is Don't Stop December. And uh, you guys have a blessed, beautiful, wonderful morning. And I will see you guys later. Peace. Rate, comment, subscribe, and share. Bye.